Hello and welcome to another episode of Two Minutes with Tim here on Heavenward Thinking. Today I want to challenge you on Psalm 34 verses 1 through 3. So I'll read it and we'll get right into this week's challenge. I will extol the Lord at all times. His praise will always be on my lips. I will glory in the Lord. Let the afflicted hear and rejoice. Glorify the Lord with me. Let us exalt his name together. As we look at these verses, they're a great reminder to us of how we should be living our lives. We should be living our lives in such a way that we praise the Lord at all times. As we go about our daily lives, it's so easy to get busy, it's so easy to get disappointed in things that don't go our way throughout the day, and yet it's so important for us to take time to reflect on the goodness of God and to give him the praise that he deserves regardless of the situations we face, regardless of the circumstances we're in. We need to remember to glorify the Lord. As Christians, that's what we are called to do. We're called to be a light in the world, to point people to Jesus by our good deeds, by what we say, what we do. We're supposed to be pointing people to Jesus. A great way to do that is to praise the Lord, whether it be individually, whether it be corporately, when we go to church or Bible study or whatever uh, meeting we go to, we can glorify the Lord individually and corporately and praise him as he deserves. These verses, again, verse 2 points out that let the afflicted hear and rejoice. So it's not only those who are going through great times that can praise the Lord. It's all of us can praise the Lord all the time, regardless of what we're going through. It's not always going to be easy as as Christians in this life. We're going to face many, many trials. We're going to go through hard times in life, but we should remember to praise the Lord. And as we praise the Lord, that will also change our perspective of things and put things in the right perspective, give us a heavenward thinking perspective of life. If we are focusing on the Lord and giving him the praise and the glory in our lives and our eyes will be lifted off of our dark or disappointing circumstances and they will reorient our focus to focus on Jesus as we should be focused every day. That's my challenge for you this week and I hope you'll join us next time for another episode of Two Minutes with Tim here on Heavenward Thinking.